Aichi. Got it. Hi YouTube, this is Goose from Malterev. Uh, we've been asked by Rald Skin um, to review a pair of Easy Rider jeans. Now, I'm going to read this email of Ian from Rald Skin to start with. Right, it says, just so you know, they are a 40% Kevlar and 60% denim mix. AA rated single layer jean. Armour is level 2 and they have two pockets for the knee armour so you can adjust the height. So if your knees are a bit wonky you can have one up one down. The mesh lining has two jobs. One is to keep you cool. The other importantly is if you hit the deck the initial impact can shear the skin from your leg. But our mesh acts as a sort of lubricant. So the jean moves slightly and saves the skin damage on impact. All very gruesome, but we learnt this from a surgeon we know. He actually advised us, and it works a treat. Just don't test it. Trust me, it is very painful. I believe we are one of the very few brands to employ this technology. I'm just going to read off the internet what it says, the specifications of these road skin. Okay then, so what it says on uh, the Road Skin website, it says that these multi-bike jeans by Road Skin, Easy Rider, which I will show you in a minute, go through some I've got here, uh, but I'll explain in a moment. The Easy Rider AA rated motorcycle jeans, AA rated single layer motorbike jeans. Motorcycle News Best Buy for Protective Motorcycle Jeans in May 2021. These motorcycle jeans are made using a unique mix of 60% denim, 40% DuPont Kevlar, and incredibly strong yet lightweight denim. The single layer construction that uses 40% aramid fibers throughout the jeans means there are no weak areas or patches. It is rare for the motorcycle jeans to be tough enough to pass a CE double A rating whilst being a single skin jean. The result is a reinforced straight legged motorcycle jean that is wonderfully light as well as highly protective. And I can vouch for that because I wore them for a few days absolutely comfortable. Uh, easy rider motorbike jeans are intended for warmer days or for when a normal fashion jean weight and feel is preferred. Easy Rider men's motorcycle jeans are just as comfortable off as on your bike, making them an ideal garment to wear when you are away from your bike as well as on it. I've been vouched for that as well. Perfect for ride outs or race meetings. Um, these jeans are manufactured so you can spend more time in them in the day. You haven't got to keep changing over because they're very comfortable and they're very safe. So that's all I've got on there. So this is my personal view on the jeans. Uh, you'll see some footage later of me actually wearing the jeans when we went to Ellen Valley. Um, uh, I'm used to wearing Oxford textiles or leathers, but the textile trousers in the warm weather absolutely make me sweat. The sweat, oh my gosh, the sweat absolutely drips from me, even if the weather's just gone up a little bit. So when I was asked to have a look at these jeans, I says, bring it on. Actually, these jeans are so comfortable that, I'll just quickly show you here, well, skin. They're, they're lightweight, but to be honest, to compare them with another jean, motorcycle jean, I can't, because I've never had another pair. So these are the first pair of that. They're, Ideal for me, uh, I'm a 32 waist. These fit me perfectly. Really comfortable, lightweight. Uh, but I tell you what, they're a great jean. And what I don't like to see, which a lot of us bikers don't, is the younger generation, mainly, but I could be wrong, there's some older generations that go out in shorts. I know textiles, a bit cumbersome, a bit heavy, 
genes like this for the younger generation because they do three different types which I will uh, ask Craig to put on as well. Uh, I think there's some skinnier fit but these are ideal for me, my age, 50, 53 year old, they're ideal for me. Fashion wise look good, well so the wife says. Um, but yeah, they're very great, brilliant jeans, comfortable as hell. But if the younger people, these ones on the scooters, the little one two fives, a lot of them don't wear no protection at all. And I've seen some terrible injuries without wearing the safety. Perhaps if they wore something like this, you can't tell a uh, like safety wear because they, they just blend in with normal jeans. To be honest, so. I will put my head camera on and then I will just go over these jeans. Easy Rider jeans, they're straight legged. I haven't washed them yet, but this is the inside of them. So you've got the hip protection in the sides there, which fit inside the jeans. And I must say, you've got the both there. Also, let me just pull inside, I hope you can see this. It's on the knees, if I pull them inside out there, and this material, you've got two areas. The one, I mean, now I'm not going to mess about with that, and then you've got the other one there because they're set lovely for me. Uh, the only thing I need to look at, which I will do now, is how you wash them. But I will have a look in a minute and then I will mention how you wash them. But to be honest, these jeans, I mean, I've worn them for two days. They have actually not, like, you know, when you get a pair of jeans and they stretch, after a couple of days you need a belt on them. These have done none of that. I don't know if it's the fact that they haven't been washed yet. I would definitely recommend them. And just like wearing, you know, sometimes when you think, oh, I could just pop up the shop on my motorbike. And then you think, oh, I've got to put my textiles on or put my levers on, cumbersome. These, you could put these on and wear them all day. They're that good. The only, it's not a downside to me, because I still managed to do it, but the only thing, it might be my boots or something, but when I try to get, I put my boots on, oh, hang on, let me just think. Yeah, I put these jeans on, and this is not a criticism at all. It's just probably me. I, I do struggle to get this. My boots are quite, I've got the silly vertebrae boots, and I like to pull these out of the top of my boot. So when I try to pull them out of the top of my boots, it's a bit, a bit awkward. But once I'm over, it's fine. It's just that initial thing. So if I could change anything with these jeans, it would be perhaps put a little, I, don't, I really don't think it needs nothing major, just a little cut up there, but like stitched. Or just have a little bit of a veiny. Would give you just, that's just on these jeans and that's just me being picky. But, these jeans are amazing, they look good. I mean, I've got a, quite a few of the bikers. The same, why haven't you got um, proper jeans on? Because you're not, I says, These aren't proper jeans. So I turned around, showed them my thing, wild skin, and they says, Oh, okay. So then I started knocking on my knees and, and I explained to them that the Kevlar, and they was amazed how good they looked. Thought that was normal jeans because they're that lightweight. They're not bit thick and cumbersome. Absolutely. It was a joy to wear them and in this and it was hot. So during that hot few days, very rare we get them. These was great. My legs breathe beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. I can't rate them enough to be honest, because they are for me brilliant jeans. Uh, I know there's a few more. I think these retail at $149.99, but what price do you put on your legs? If you come off your bike and slide, what price would you put on your legs? You can't be stupid when it comes to your legs or any part of your body. So, and I hear that routes can do, um, which would be interesting to try out, um, a hoodie, which sometimes, like when you put these big textile jackets on, an hoodie with protection in. It's got to be the right, oh, it's got to be brilliant. So I will have a look at the hoodies, I think, as well. So I'll probably get me an hoodie and then I will do another review on the hoodie. So at this time, I'm going to jump over now. The next thing I'll be talking about is washing them.
Uh, but as you can see there, it says no ironing and no washing. And on the label, it's and wash only. So uh, I would do these then, um, really, as I just got over this here, approved, is I would, let's have a look at the warning sign inside then. I'm gonna always remove the impact protectors before washing this item damage to the protectors structure and consequent loss of protection so everything's sort of in there so really I think personal choice how oh, you would um, wash these but how I would do it bowl of warm water not red hot water warm water I just put my salty suds in like Ariel dad whatever the wife's got in my opinion they are fantastic, a brilliant pair of jeans and literally you could wear them to go out in because they don't look, well they're not heavy, they're not cumbersome, you can't tell there's padding in them where, and there is padding, fantastic pair of jeans. So thank you Road Skin, peace out.